So hi everyone and welcome back. So let's review the what happened during the weekend for the various Asian players that are playing in Europe and not just the weekend because I'm um, gonna start from him. Hong Hyun Seok scored uh, on Thursday in the Europa Conference League qualifying game for Ghent. A uh, European goal is always important, but especially when it's in a qualifying game, it's really, really, really important because uh, to qualify or not qualify to a group phase of a, a, a European competition is really important for basically every team. So uh, it's a lot of money that comes in and obviously the season can change. The season can change if you're doing a European competition or not. Uh, so he scored against the uh, Cyprus, uh, Cyprus located team of Aquel and uh, from a Korean player we're gonna go to another one that is Lee Jae Sung. He scored for Mainz the opening goal against Eintracht Frankfurt. Uh, the game uh, ended in a tie on a draw 1-1. One -one. Uh, important point for Mainz uh, against a good and well organized team of Eintracht Frankfurt. Uh, Lee Jae Sung was really, uh, really like good on being in the position, position well into the area to put the, the ball in with a header. And I'm going to talk on how every player that has scored, either scored or given assist, like Koji Miyoshi for Birmingham, have either won their game or draw. So either a win or a draw if a Asian player scores or gives an assist. So that's that's a really good statistic for uh, for Asian players in Europe and hopefully we're gonna see more and more uh, going forward in the next years and I'm gonna be sure I'm gonna I'm, I'm sure that that this is gonna happen I'm gonna be there to cover them hopefully in the future anyways uh, let's continue uh, Takumi Minamino scores again for Marco great start of the season for him uh, Monaco unfortunately tied the game against Nantes. They were hoping for a win, but a really important and nice goal for Takumi Amino with a header. Koki Saito scored twice uh, for uh, Sparta Rotterdam. Uh, they were playing in Edelman against Edelman. They won 3-1. Um, yeah, I mean, the first goal, he was well positioned to put it in. It was an easy tap-in. The second one was a really nice, a really nice a goal from outside the area. Uh, it's not the best goal of these. Of these, um, I'm gonna say which one is the best at the end of the video. Shuto Machino. Uh, I was always saying Shuto Machino, but it's uh, actually I think it's Shuto Machino. Scores for. <laughs> I mean, I, it happens. Uh, scores for uh, Kiel in their big and important win against Schalke in Schalke in Gelsenkirchen. In, in Schalke, in Gelsenkirchen, and of course, Schalke is not city. And yeah, I mean, great for him. This is an important game, and the survival in this league is really important. Like it, the second tier of German football is really competitive, and it's really nice to see him scoring and be be. And he had also also even other opportunities to to score a goal or give an assist. So that's great. And uh, the last player, Asian player, scored in Europe this, during this weekend is Hawaiyao Kawabe. He scored one goal for Standard VIG in uh, Kortrik, uh, against Kortrik. Uh, the game ended with a draw. And it's very, it's very nice to see how uh, Kawabe scoring. Uh, he's a good player. Good to, that he, he always makes his job. Uh, like into the, the team and I mean it's really nice to see him scoring and as I said before uh, the only assist for Asian players during this weekend was for Kaji Miyoshi in Birmingham of course the only in the top like top tiers or most important uh, leagues in Europe of course ch the championship is not the top tier in England it's the second tier but I mean it's uh, still an important league in Europe Koji Miyoshi scored, uh, scored, has given an assist for Birmingham in their win against Plymouth and yeah, good for him. Uh, I think he he also has scored last weekend or was another assist, I'm not really sure, but good for him. So uh, the best goal of the weekend, it's not in the weekend because it's a goal from Hong Hyun Seok. He basically had the, the ball coming in from uh, from the air, basically going down, he, he kicks it in, I really a bomb, a banger, 
and that was a great goal uh, go check it out if you didn't uh, it's really, really nice so uh, last week I, I talked on how I want to make uh, like basically a standing like uh, thing uh, on the best players each weekend then give them like a, a little trophy a little prize at the end of the um, of the of the year so it's a little game for this channel so I'm gonna give the top five players and for obviously for um, each player each each position you get like 10 points 8 points 5 points 2 points and 1 point something like that so I'm gonna give the best player of this weekend uh, the two 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 let's say I'm doing it right now Let's say Koki Saito, he, he, he scored two absolutely important uh, goals for Sparta Rotterdam, the second one was very really nice. Uh, the second I'm gonna give it to Shuto Makino, then Hong Yoon Seok. Uh, oh. Yeah, yeah, no, no. Now, second I'm gonna give it to Takumi Minamino, uh, Hong Yoon Seok, Lee Jae Sung. No, hold on. <laughs> okay, Lee Jae Sung, Hong Yoo Seok, nice goal that day, and the fifth to Shuto Makino because he played really well. I was thinking of giving it to Heung Min Son, he's playing really well. James Madison, his uh, new teammate, has has talked very really nice about him and he's playing really well, even though he's, he hasn't uh, scored or given any assist this season yet. But yeah, uh, this is the standards for today and yeah that's pretty much it for this video <laughs> uh, i hope to see you all soon i'm gonna make uh, some other videos during the week about the standings about other stuff whatever happens thanks for watching and i hope to see you very soon